Ah, it's blue, it's green, it's attacking everything. Now you have a cyanobacterial problem, also known as blue-green algae. It's just something that you don't want in your tanks. Just like when you defend against Messi, you can't and it sucks. Now often mistaken as algae, this is actually a kind of bacteria issue. But it thrives in good lighting conditions. It ain't harmful for fish, but it's really something that you just don't want in your tank, yeah? But it's bad for your plants. Look at how much it covers the leaves. That's something you really don't want. Some say that it also makes the aquarium smell bad and you don't want that. So, now that you have this problem, you must be thinking, how do I nip this issue right in its 2.1 billion old bacterial bump? Uh. Yes, you heard it right. It's been on this planet for 2.1 billion years already. So how do we get rid of it? Here are four tried and tested tips to how to navigate around this issue. Join me. Tip number one is to reduce your light intensity. So there's a reason why it's also called green algae problem because first it looks like algae. And secondly, they work the same as algae and plants. They photosynthesize and that's how they actually create the food and multiply. So naturally speaking, you reduce your light, you reduce their food source and then they are not able to photosynthesize as well. Second tip is to improve the water flow. So cleaning out your filters, ensuring that the water flows well within the tank itself. So this will also help improve the overall water quality and hopefully it will help lessen the issue or at least slow down the multiplication. Remember guys, this is a bacteria, not algae. So, third tip, remove them physically. Yes, unlike some algae, it's actually really quite easy to remove, just that they're just everywhere around the tank. So during your regular maintenance, clear big chunks of it, they actually fall off the leaves by just swiping them around with water. So you can see it's literally falling out from the leaf and I'm shaking the water here. Spotting them, removing them is actually quite integral to combating this uh, cyanobacterial problem actually. They tend to hide around stagnant surface water, underneath these floating plants, along, around the leaves, all around actually. And last but not least, introducing a magic weapon which is called this blue-green slime stain remover. This does a magical job in removing uh, tank from this blue green algae works like paw patrol you know they are so efficient Ew, so this product literally has one job and it does it so well so here's how i used it so there's some instructions on the back you just need to follow the dosage level so every two level spoonfuls for 15 gallons of aquarium water this is how the product looks like comes with a spoon too so you just need to dissolve these pink crystals in the water so just pull out some aquarium water and then mix it up together. Then you can pour the dissolved solution into the aquarium. My tank is a 60p, so naturally I did two doses of this. So they said repeat these steps every 48 hours. So after I dosed it, I just left it there, let it do its thing. And I came back after 48 hours and I didn't even need to go through the second dose. That's how serious and how quick it happens. None on the surface, none on the floating plants, none on the leaves. It's just gone, it's just gone. So the reason why I actually placed it as the last tip, although it's so effective, I mean, it's always better to have natural means of removing something first um, before you introduce something new. Yeah, it's not harmful for fish. These pink crystals are not harmful for fish. But naturally, you know, the best way is natural. Always. So there they are. Those are my four tips on how you can get rid of your blue-green bodies. The sign of bacteria birds. So hope this helps you in one way or another. So stay red people, if you like this video or this content, feel free to hit the like, subscribe, you know, it will mean a whole lot. Thanks for watching. Check out my other videos too. Okay, bye.